this are the first news. IDF, Israeli Defense Force, finds Hezbollah posts on Israeli territory. On the Israeli side of border with Lebanon in the area of Mount Dov, the military discovered a position established by the terror group about two months ago. The army is trying to resolve the matter through diplomatic channels. This is a provocation, they don't pose a threat. It was a say, but no doubt that such a situation not simple is a manage to go instant to invade, invade into this place, the Israeli area. So let us see, by the way, this is the Israeli news, it means the same thing, Hezbollah did this place against the Israeli army. Okay, so let us see now what the table says. Very interesting, old table, but it's very relevant to the situation. So in this table you see the Bachrit Ayamim, interesting, purple, Bachrit, and the end of days. Interesting, we speak, we are now in the end of days. And all this development, how they have to do with it. So we have here for the letter Chet of Bachrit we have the, in purple, the word Hezbollah, Hezbollah comes here. And amazingly, Hezbollah, this is the army of Hezbollah which is here. Hezbollah comes with Iran, meaning with the Torah, really showing the connection between Hezbollah and Iran. Iran, meaning with the Torah, letter after letter, quite an Then you have in the same line, Lachas Teror, pressure of terror. It means that terror comes now and very often, only yesterday for the killed and before frightening. And if everything has to do with Iran because they are giving the money for the terrorists to buy weapons, to buy all these things, yeah. And then we have here also the Hamas, who I think of the Hamas interesting because they are also with Hezbollah together doing all this trouble to Israel, the terror. Yeah, they are pushing really the terror, Lachas. Pressure of terror, they are fighting almost every day. Then, what you have here, the evil forces, definitely, as always we mentioned, that the evil forces of Lilith, Lilith is a evil force, angel of the last, you know, the Ishmael, last, prostitution, everything is to do with the uh, illicit things means with lust, yeah, all this kind of transgression of the Torah against lust. Then you have also the male, yeah, the male comes here, you can see in in purple, the Samael, Samael, Samael have to do with the left. Yeah, the same letters basically, only some have seen are changeable. So the left is war against the Torah. So we really, three times a day, in the Shemona in the prayer, we have written, asking God, remove from us these evil forces of Lili Samael, which refers to these forces here. So then we have here also the Amman of today, once we have uh, Iran, so we have today what our Rebbe tell us, if Jews would not do tshuva willingly, then he will appoint upon them a very cool leader, like Haman in Persia, Iran comes here with Iran. So what we should do, so comes here, tshuva, repentance, and our Rebbe tell us. The Talmud, Tartek Sanhedrin, <laughs> more than 2,000 years ago, if Jews don't do Shuvah, so God will point out from them very cruel leader like Haman in Egypt, and he will decree very <laughs> serious decrees against Israel to destroy, to kill. 
And just we have to do shuva, to pray to God, yeah. Then we see here, very interesting, the same line, when the terror, you know, the pressure, you have Messiah, because this will bring people to do shuva. And the shuva, you have shuva in green, will bring Messiah. Then we have Messiah again here, Mashiach here in red. And in fact, you have Messiah also again. A Mashiach, very interesting. So, by the way, you have the Shabbos here. You see the Shabbos clearly here, because Shabbos is one of the most important things you do have to keep. Because, because of the dedication of Shabbos, if you remember, it's written on Rebbe Selah, Emelech at Khan. You have Lebanon here, because it's also a oh, lot of troubles come from there. So, looking at those names which you have here, are really names of Esther, Mordechai, and uh, in fact, you have the four names of the Messiah, which are Menachem, and the another name is Inon in gray, and then you have Shiloh, and then you have Inon, Inon four names, and Hanina, sorry, Hanania. So those names are really for one person, but they have different meaning. Menachem means he will come to comfort Jews for all their troubles. <laughs> they suffer terribly. Then another name, Hanania, in yellow. He will have grace upon us, pity upon us. And then you have the name Shiloh, because uh, the name Shiloh represents that the world will realize the great things of the Messiah. Helping the world, gives him present, Shilol, present to him. So basically, those names are mean, have meaning, and this is exactly what they are doing to comfort Israel. And they will, in all rulership, they will rule, really. They will accept it as uh, leaders, as the Torah said. So, very interesting and significant table because it's really it's unbelievable that exactly from the head of the, the end of days come Hezbollah, a lot of letters. And then Iran is minimal, unbelievable, yeah. Iran, the full writing. And then the same line, you have a pressure of terror, which we have today very much. And Messiah, because this is exactly the reason for troubles to bring Jews to repent, to do Shuvah. So, as I said, very <laughs> relevant table to our time. <laughs> Troubles, you know, uh -huh. are now very strong by terrorists, and also now his in the north. Trouble starts. So, all together, we are not in a simple time now. And hoping that really will do Shuvah, like our Rabbi Selah, no, the Travis comes to bring people to return to God, to realize that only God can help us, not America, not uh, other nations, not only God. So, very interesting and significant table with the news, as we said, that it's really today, and it's frightening that they manage the Hezbollah to enter this area and his weapons and so on <laughs> to be near the army, the Israeli army. Not a good sign at all. So, let us hope that Jews uh, really will do Shuvah, will repent, keep the Shabbos, purity of life of men and women. So, We'll have peace and quiet, Israel and the world, if not. <laughs> but the Torah says, if you don't keep the, ter the Torah, then terrible curses come.
So this is the army of the Hezbollah, and uh, which just now was found out as a, <laughs> our, in the uh, area of Israel. And maybe the threatening, no, no doubt. So, also we are now in the month of Tammuz, Cancer, as we said. Not a good time for this. <laughs> So, as I said, the only thing we can say our situation is repentance. 